to my channel so today i'm finally going back to school shopping i know i started this video out and i just know it went completely left first of all my whole life has just went completely left in this past couple of weeks but i'm not about to just give y'all my sad story me and my mom are soon to be going back to school shopping i don't know what stores i'm going to but this is mainly for my apartment i don't really need school supplies because i got a lot of school supplies last time so we're gonna be going to the stores and then we're gonna be shopping for our, our new apartment so my mom is here now and i'm gonna be vlogging <laughs> say hi to the vlog Oh, thanks. Are you recording me? Yeah. When I was coming? No, I'm telling them what we're doing today. Should I fold it? Me and my sister, my cousin, and my friend were all moving into an apartment together this semester. And we all have like different... <laughs> We all have like different things that we're in charge of getting. My mom is gonna help us decorate and get all the good stuff for our living room because that's what I'm in charge of. So, we have arrived, wait, <laughs> at Raw. This is like the best place to get home decor for low. So let's go and see what they have. Hopefully they have good stuff. <laughs> Sorry. You're okay. You can go. <laughs> <laughs> Got your whole picture set up. <laughs> Do you guys like this? I'm just about to start putting a whole bunch of stuff in the car. I'm hoping. So, guys, we have like a little checklist and everything. I know I want to get candles, but that may be like the least of my worries right now. I don't know y'all, we'll see. Guys, I'm actually upset because this place barely has that many things. I'm trying to find things, but they ain't got that much. Um, let me see. So I found this painting. I hope it looks good in that apartment. So this is where we are so far. Two carts full with a few things in the front. Um, I found most of the things. I'm not completely happy with this Ross that I came to, but my mom says we. I'm not gonna have time to go tomorrow, but I don't know. I'm probably gonna order everything else. I don't like this. I don't even see. Is that a candle? Ooh, no. But is it? If it's our last resort, should we just get it? Because it's only $4.99, right? It's $9.01. <laughs> see, they even have like a kitchen section. We got way more things. These are our carts right now. Um, are the bowls the same or what? Say it was moving forward. So the way me and my mom are doing it is these are like the things for our apartment So we're gonna do like keep that over here and then these are for her daughters So we have all of our stuff me and my sister's thing And then we were able to find all of these things This is like huge and so far we spent about like $700 Alright y'all, so these are all the things we got. It's dark in here and my camera's about to die. So I will give you guys a full tour haul of all the things I got. Plus the clothes and shoes and all that stuff I bought for school before this vlog is over. So for this segment of the video, I'm going to be showing you guys some of the clothes and shoes and stuff that I got for back to school. I know I'm going to be doing like two parts of the haul because I got clothes obviously and then you guys saw yesterday I went back to school shopping. So I have like all the things from my apartment and my basement. I mean I'm not bringing it to my room but I have like all my clothes upstairs. After I'm done like showing you guys some of the things that I got I'm probably gonna just take everything downstairs because it's all gonna go to my apartment anyway. But I'm just gonna you know show you guys some of the things that I got. I'm trying to decide if I really want to try everything on or I don't know. I think I will. 
Okay, yeah. So I'm just gonna start off with the things that I got from Ross because like, I mean, I went there yesterday. So first I have this Juicy Couture like velour set. It's pajamas. And you know, college girls need pajamas. Oh, I never even showed you guys the collection of house. So I just put all the things on my bed so that, you know, I can just grab it and show you guys. Yeah, so this is just a like a velvet suit. It's not even, ooh, it has Juicy on the back. That's cute, okay. Yeah, okay, and then next up, I have this other Juicy Couture top. This honestly could be a dress because I got it in a size large, but um, this was the only size they had, so. This is what I mean by Ross always has like the good finds because if you are a real Juicy Couture like lover, you know that like they were discontinued and then they saw that everybody liked their clothes and that it's like kind of vintage and stuff. So then they like relaunched and then they started taxing on all their things. Like they were taxing before the relaunch, but they decided like, yeah, the girls are eating up our stuff, so let's still tax. So no, if you go to like Ross, or sometimes like Marshalls, TJ Maxx, places like that, they have a lot of their items. Okay, and I also got this pink juicy robe. It's so cute. This one was kind of, it wasn't expensive, mind you. In addition to them having these juicy couture items, they're always like, not cheaper, but like for discounted price. prices. It was less than $24, or maybe it is $24. I don't know. So yeah, this is cute. It's like the same texture as the shorts. It's a different pink, but just another row. Mind you, I already have another one. <laughs> and my mom, I'm pretty sure she got it from there as well. I'm a juicy girl, so. All right, and lastly from Ross, I got these earlier in the summer. These are Michael Kors, um, Michael Kors, like, bedroom slippers. I just thought they were really cute and, like, fancy, so I got them and then, like, they're just really cute, so I got them. <laughs> And y'all, I just did my hair, period. The back probably looks crazy, but it's cute anyway. So now I'm gonna show you guys like a few items that I got earlier this summer that was just specifically for school, but I did wear them this summer. Ah. I was so pressed to get these because like, I worked hard for these. I feel like this was the like, um, most expensive purchase I made this summer probably. They were 700 and something dollars, but you know, there's these like Gucci platform slides. I was really pressed to get these because I don't know, they're just so cute. Um, I have worn them before. I'll put a picture here of me with them on. You guys saw what they look like, but they're super cute. And yeah, I only wear them once. Like the back is still super clean. Okay, I bet in the other pair of shoes I got were these dunks. But I don't wear like Nikes really. I don't really wear Jordans. I'm not really a sneaker girl, honestly. I like slides and sandals and stuff like that. When I was younger and like middle school, I wore like a lot of sneakers, but I'm just not really into it. But I'm trying to get into it. So yeah, I got those. Um, I also wore those once this summer. I also put a picture here. I think they're really cute though. So they do go with everything. And I noticed a lot of people have them. So I don't know how often I would wear them, but they are super cute. So yeah, those are the two shoes I got. Like I'm just the person that has like a lot of shoes. Like I have a lot of everything. So I just didn't feel the need to like go out and buy a whole bunch of shoes that I knew I was gonna wear. So yeah, those are the only two shoes I got. And then now I'm just gonna do the Shein portion because I did like a bulk purchase and I do have more clothes coming from like other places but it's just like the shipping just didn't work out I guess it's probably I think one was supposed to be delivered yesterday but I don't have the key to my mailbox right now so it's okay because I have so many things to show y'all and y'all probably won't even notice that I am missing some items so yeah let's just get started with the Shein portion and then if I have time I'm gonna go downstairs and show you guys the apartment shopping if not I can show you guys after my last client which is like a little later. So yeah, let's Okay, so first up from Shein, I got these like medium wash denim jeans. They're skinny, but I got them in a size 27 and I still feel like they're a little bit big. Like, they're not like big, but like, I don't know. They're just not super fitted. I mean, yeah, you guys can see like, and I'm just not a big fan of jeans like that, but they are still cute. Like I like getting pants from Shein because like, why not? Wait, no, these are big. Okay, y'all. So, next up, I have this cute, very freaking cute pink crop top. I'm gonna be wearing the same bra throughout the video, so if you can see a little bit of this pink sports bra, then just don't mind it. Yeah, so I got this pink top. It's like knitted, and the quality feels really good. 
and the back is like shorter than the front it just has like this thing but i feel like it's just it's really giving i would rate them but like i don't know there's no need for a reading you guys are just seeing what i got so yeah this is cute okay guys so this is the next top i have um it's cute it's nude i mean it's not really much to it it's like i wouldn't say it's hard to move in but like it's not something you could just be like you know because yeah but and it's cute and it's knit i think the quality is just superb like she had really been stepping their game up but yeah i think this is really cute honestly fabric just does it for me honestly it disregards the pink undergarment but next up i have this black bodysuit <laughs> and these gray biker shorts the bike the bodysuit is just like a basic like high neck one because i just haven't had one in a little bit and then these shorts i think they're called like contrast shorts they both fit like so i just applaud myself for the sizing choices that i picked i don't remember the sizes that i picked but i know that it's fitting and it's doing dang hole in the chest hole in the uh, shoulders crop top is really cute honestly i didn't think it would look like this on me but obviously i want to wear with this with these pants but what I was saying was I do think this is really cute also because of the fabric like I said Shein has been winning and doing it for me because of their like quality lately my sister always thought like they were like you know bottom of the barrel because of their quality now for me the only issue with them is just everybody shops there so it's like you know you might go out and see somebody else with the same outfit as you all right y'all so next up I have this white lace corset this is so cute like this is my favorite one so far because i don't have anything like this i mean obviously i've seen it before but i just don't have anything like this you can wear it with the straps on or without i think it's cute both ways and then the back looks like this but this is just really really cute to me because like i said i don't have anything like this period get into it it's like cute for like the girl night out all right so next up i have this green crop top i would wear this with the bra i just didn't feel like putting it back on i mean it's just a basic crop top some of the things you guys will see in this little mini haul is that they're just basic and i mean i am going to school i'm a college student so like i'm not gonna look or feel like dressing up every single day i mean maybe for like the first week i'm gonna look cute and stuff but like trust me i experienced last year i really would just roll out of bed and wear a tank top leggings and keep it pushing because i mean who is the fashion show for pwi mentality <laughs> but yeah i think this is so cute you know i don't have anything like this once again the texture is doing it for me i'm gonna try to like you know get as close as possible so you guys can see the textures that i'm talking about next up i do have another basic outfit or like basic top or whatever this is really cute i like the feel of it like i'm pretty sure all the shirts that i got in this haul were a size six or a medium and all of them fit literally perfectly like a glove but not like uncomfortably because i noticed that like sometimes i may feel uncomfortable but these so far are doing it for me like I said, you do want to have like a select few different types of like outfits and stuff. Not always go out, go out, go out because you're going to waste all your outfits on school. So next up, I have four different shirts. Like I said, like I'm really happy that I got these because like it just really makes me proud that I'm being smart and like getting items that, you know, I'm, I'll be able to use. So these are all the same, but it came in a pack. So it's just like one of those like high neck. So I'm gonna try on this one and then obviously you guys can get the gist with the rest of them. I don't see the need to try on all. Okay, so this is like the brownish like undertone of orange. I really like it. I would try on all of them, but I actually struggled to get this over my big head. Yeah, this is really cute. It definitely is gonna come in handy on days I don't feel like doing too much, but still wanna look cute. Get y'all some. I think this is really cute. It'll come really in handy when I want to just wear something basic and dress it up with like a cute bag, shoes, accessories and stuff. I did get some like jewelry pieces. I just got these earrings because I keep running out of earrings. And then this is a, like these little small hoop earrings. I don't even wear stuff like this, but I'm just like, I'm trying to get out of my comfort zone. So I just got them. So I also bought this hat. <laughs> It's kind of random, but you know, hats are always convenient. Like if your hair is not, ooh, this is not cute. Or maybe my head is small, or maybe it's a hairstyle. 
<laughs> okay now i'm sure it'll look good if i have like a wig on or something but like yeah it comes in handy like if you don't have your hair done or if you have like a wig and the top you just don't feel like doing it a cat is definitely necessary i didn't have one i had like my sisters when i was living home but like you know like i'm not gonna be always asking for a date so i do have a few more items so hang tight lady i think while i'm here i can just show you guys also what i got so this haul that i have so here with you guys i spent over a thousand dollars because i did get some bundles from kendra's boutique I got three long bundles, 30, 28, 26. I'm gonna install these for back to school. Um, y'all, I know y'all are probably like, girl, these are scant, but I do have some old Kendra's Boutique hair that, that I had since ninth grade. So y'all, get y'all some Kendra's Boutique because literally ninth grade, it's been like five school years, five or six school years, because I'm about to be a sophomore now. So almost five years, but like I'm able to use the bundles that I had from ninth grade and added to like the front for this install because you know the front will be a little bit shorter than the back so yeah i did spend a good amount of money and um there was a sale i got this for like four something and her hair like when i first totaled everything that i wanted originally it was like five something so i was like dang i don't know if i'm about to buy some 500 dollars hair okay so next up i have this other crop top you guys can see it has like ridges on the side just a little bit of detailing not much to it but the back does have well this part does have like the slit with regular bras it wouldn't be this low with my sports bra so don't even worry about all that y'all and then this side it's like kind of like asymmetrical like it just goes like this and then this side it, they're just so they're not long enough i thought they would cover my feet i like pants that cover my feet unless they're leggings if they don't hug your ankles they should not be off the floor it has like detailing right here so yeah it's the texture for me again y'all like what the heck it feels so nice and thick and like good quality i haven't touched or wore anything today Shein, you did your thing all right so the last Shein item would be this two-piece set it's really cute the only thing is that i've seen i literally just see this one girl with it on and i was like dang but yeah that's what i said that's the only downside to Shein. you're probably gonna see somebody else with it on but it's cute just a nice two-piece this is really cute i don't know hmm yeah i just i don't know <laughs> they have like these ridges on it now lastly i did get some pink bubblegum skims but unfortunately it wasn't the ones that i wanted so from this bubblegum collection this was the one i was saying that i didn't really want i mean it's just like a regular tank top and then on the um like this part it says skims on it i mean what can i do with this kimberly tell me what can i do with the top like this is literally just pajamas I, this is i bet this alone was probably like 40 dollars because my whole order total was like 99 dollars. so this had to be like 40 because i know the other one was more expensive but yeah i mean i just got it anyway because i'm like i have to get something from this collection there's no way i'm gonna let everyone get all the products so yeah so this is the final item of the clothing portion of this video i like this one because it has like this little thing right here like the darker you know thing if i had the pants to go with this like it would be really cute i don't know both of these items are really just giving me pajamas vibe so you can like change the buttons and stuff okay cute 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 so yeah i like this i really do like this i knew i was gonna like it and it does look small off of me but it fits perfectly so cute i also got a nose ring that has like that little dangly thing but i don't know how i feel about things like that so i'll try it on and I'll see if it even suits me. And then if not, I won't wear it. Back to the hair. They even gave me a bonnet. A Kendra's Boutique bonnet. I feel so sturdy. Oh my God. Let me try it real quick. Perfect. I like it. All right. I'm trying to make sure that I didn't leave anything out. If I did leave anything out, it's okay. Because I showed you guys the majority of what I did get. Um, like I said, I have a client. So I'm going to go do lashes. Once I'm finished with lashes, I'm going to show you guys everything that I got from Ross yesterday. And everything that I've been ordering. Because I've ordered almost everything from my room from Amazon. And then, yeah, it's just going to be a big haul. And I want this video out by tomorrow. Playing games. Like, no games. I have really been slacking. So, I just have so many back-to-school videos for you guys. 
so i will catch up with you guys later hey guys so as you guys can see i'm in my basement for my real supporters i'm sure y'all sure y'all remember the same exact spot from last year when i was moving into my dorm and stuff and i did a whole tour i'm not sure if i have more stuff this year or last year i think i probably had more last year because i didn't get as much for myself this year because i knew i had some things that i really liked from last year so i'm just going to show you guys everything that we got from ross yesterday and everything that i've been ordering from amazon just everything that i bought for school so far yeah so we could just get into it for real <laughs> so first i wanted to start off with the bigger items this is a huge painting i'm not sure if you guys can see how big it is on camera but it's basically my height, just a little bit shorter. And I'm 5'6 now, I think. Yeah, I'm 5'6. So this is probably like about 5'4. No, probably like 5 feet. This is really tall. And I want to use it as obviously wall art. I could put it this way or that way. So yeah, that was the first thing I got from Ross. And it was $60. I think it's worth the price. I mean, actually, I think a lot of things are not worth the price. But I'm sure if I went to like any other store, it would have been for like probably $100. So yeah, that's why I was not playing when I said don't sleep on Ross. They have like literally everything that would be overpriced somewhere else. So yeah, next up, I got this rug. I kind of just went against my fate with it because I really wanted a pink rug, but one of my roommates and friend Layla said she didn't want a pink rug. So I saw this one and it has like a little bit of pink and like different colors in it because our couches are like kind of grayish with the undertone of like dark blue kind of. So I feel like this will go perfect with it. I just have to make sure all the accessories that I get like, you know, blend and go with this whole theme that we're at. So let's just get into all the bags. Yeah, for my sister's items, I'm just gonna put them to the side because like, it's okay. <laughs> First off, I got this um, window curtain. I'm a little nervous about actually moving in with it because um, I, in the picture in my room, I can tell that there's no like curtain rod for me to actually like put my window curtains on. I may have to be ghetto and like DIY it or something just for the year because I really like to get things done in one day. Like I'm really hoping that I move in next Thursday and then everything is done by like Saturday. Like I don't like waiting weeks and weeks. Then my mom got us a set of 10 washcloths. This was also from Ross. Um, it was $6, pink and purple. Okay, my mom of course got me and my sister both two pillow sets each. I like four pillows, so I'm probably gonna bring two for my house. But they have, you know, it comes in the pack like this. Just keeping it simple. Let's see how much this was. This was $17 for two. So if y'all went back to school shopping already, I want y'all to like compare the prices in the comments and be like, oh, I got this for that price. So I'll know if I'm really tripping. So I ordered this like um, food grader from Amazon. I don't remember how much it was, but I don't think it was too expensive. I think, actually no, I think it was $15 because of the way, like it's so big. The grader that I have at my house upstairs is not even this big. It's like a handheld one. This one's more like heavy duty. <laughs> so my mom got me and my sister both these shower liners. Of course you need it for the shower curtains. We didn't get, shower, I didn't get shower curtains because the ones that they had at the store yesterday were not that good. Like. Trust me, I went to the store on a bad day. My mom decorated our house and like, I know a lot of the things she got was from there and like, it looks good. So I was just really shocked that they didn't have a lot of the things that I was hoping to find. But I mean, I was still able to find little things. So my mom said, we're probably gonna go back to the store. If not, I probably would just go on my own or just order everything else when my refund check comes, I don't know. So yeah, we got this and then she also got me and my sister like a mattress protector thing. These are usually used in like dorms and stuff, but I don't know what to expect. And I mean, who doesn't want a comfortable bed? So yeah, she got both of us one. Oh, these are different. I ended up getting just one um, hand towel for like, you know, the rack in the bathroom. This is also a Juicy Couture one. And this was $4. I couldn't find any more because you know, a lot of people love pink. Pink is always gonna be, you know, the least in sock. Okay. So this actually just got delivered from Amazon. My mom got me a pink comforter set from Amazon. I don't know how much it was. I don't want to open it because this plastic seems like it's not like patchable. So yeah, this is just a pink comforter set. In addition, I also got a gray Juicy Couture sheet set. And this was $19 from um, Ross as well. Next up. <laughs> 
I also have another Juicy Couture item. This is in a, like a bed throw. Um, yeah, it's just a throw. It's like checkered with pink and it says Juicy on it. This was $13. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. This is probably the thing I was most excited for in this entire haul because it's just so pretty. And like the vision I have for my room, if it really comes to life, will be like literally perfect. So I got this neon sign that says you're like really pretty. It was, I think like $90, almost $100. The first time I got it, um, it broke and I had to send it back and they sent me a new one. The only thing that's rubbing me the wrong way is the fact that I think I'm gonna have to have it installed. So I'll get my boyfriend to do it for me, but like once you hear the word install or drills or anything like that, just know it's not getting the same day you move in. It's not gonna get done that day. And I don't like that. But I mean, you know, I'm just really impatient, so I just need to work on my patience. So yeah, this is my favorite part. I got it from Amazon. Not too expensive. Okay, now for the trash cans. My mom got three trash cans. One is for my sister and two is for me. My sister didn't come to the store, so she didn't get to like have more authority of all the things she got. My mom, she just told my mom like a color scheme and she just kind of kept asking me what she wants but i don't know what she wants i'm not gonna pick and then you know she didn't like the same thing so i got two one for my room and then one for the bathroom um i guess she could have got one another one she could get another one but i don't know she just didn't come so, so we got an egg holder for our apartment we're getting older like you know trying to be organized on our diera ish you know diera has like the ultimate organization thing so i think that's the vibe we're going for honestly and then obviously we have some dish um, dish scrubbers. My sister got a pink extension cord, so I think this is for her room. This is three ninety nine. This was three two ninety nine, and then this was six dollars. Well, five ninety nine. So for my bathroom, I got this um, little rug for when I step out the shower. I think I already showed y'all this in the vlog, but yeah, I got this rug, so as soon as I step out the shower, I'll put my feet on this. Hopefully, uh, it doesn't get dirty because, well, it shouldn't get dirty, but I know it might get wet, because I mean, if you're going in and out the shower, you know. So yeah, I like this a lot. <laughs> and then I got this foam stand. So it's a waterproof shower phone holder, so I'm gonna be listening to music, watching my shows in the shower and all that because I don't, know, I don't know the last time I bought a speaker. I usually just listen to music off my phone and it'll be convenient if I can just have it in the shower. And then we also got this cutting board. I already showed this early in the vlog, but it's so small. Like look at it compared to like my chest. Like it's small. I mean, it's not that big of a deal though. We're in an apartment. Like, you know, I don't see us cooking anything drastic. Ooh, and then I got these outlet covers. Let's see. Yeah. I got these pink outlet covers. I'm gonna have to like screw them on. Super cute, super girly, super fancy. And then I also got another um, sheet set. My mom, my mom ordered this satin sheet set for me. So I think I have one comforter and then two sets of sheets. And then for the next comforter that I get, I want it to be pink satin. Because satin sheets, silk sheets, whatever, comforter, anything silk or satin, those are like the best things for you. When it helps, like, I don't think it makes like, well, what's the word? Like, it'll help prevent like breakouts as much. I know that for sure. Like, it doesn't collect as much bacteria and all that. And then two, like, if I get hot easily. Like, I like the house to be cold. So if it is warm or whatever the case is, it'll help with that because it's just, you know, cold. And then I got this set of face masks. It's pink. I mean, this isn't really just for school, so. Anyway, so I'm gonna show you guys this little base thing that I got. And this is like my biggest issue with buying products from Amazon because they literally will have like a nice picture on there and then when it comes in person, it'll literally be the smallest thing. And it is, I mean, my room is small. I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna even let y'all know now. When we get there, don't even judge because the room is small. Like the apartment is expensive as hell because of the like amenities, like there's a pool, gym and all that stuff. And then the kitchen and all that is pretty big. But I know my room personally is pretty small. So, I mean, I guess this isn't the, bruh, like the, look at this the si compared to my head. I thought this would have at least been the size of my head. And then this, th like they're on the same type of time. These little pieces of feathers, I got the pink feathers. 
Like this might as well go in my bathroom because this is so tiny. Because, I mean, okay, it is a little small room. So I already know it can either go in my bathroom or it can go in um, like on my desk somewhere. I don't know, but I just feel like I was really played. That's the only like downside about ordering from Amazon. You never know like the lumps and stuff. Well, me and my sister both got these, um, it's a clock. And we I saw it on Amazon and it's just, um, it looks like this. And then when you turn it on, like the letters will come up and look all cool and stuff. So nothing too drastic, but yeah, just a little clock. But yeah, I also got these feathers. They're so small, bro. And these are 24 pieces. So yeah, it's 24 pieces. I'm probably gonna share with my sister if she has something to put them in. And then the other bathroom rug that I got, it says you look good, y'all. Like, I'm not playing. This is about to be fire. Y'all need to stay tuned for my apartment tour. This is gonna be so cute. So yeah, it says you look good for, I'm all about self-love and all that nice stuff. So you guys are gonna be seeing a whole bunch of conceited slogans and whatnot throughout my room. And what about it? Yeah. I even got like another LED sign, not as big as this one, but it was from Shein and it was only like $26 and it just says hello gorgeous. So if I'm able to, I'll probably put that up in my bathroom. I don't remember how much this um, this bathroom set was from Amazon, but just know when you're ordering on Amazon, you really got to compare prices. Like you got to search up online to make sure you're not being played because sometimes, sometimes, um, like I know originally when I first bought this, I think I bought it for 116 and I was able to find another one for cheaper when I ordered it the second time. So yeah. So along with the with the um the outlet covers, I also got like the light switch cover. I only got one. Hopefully there's only one there for my room, but I got three outlet covers because those those usually have more. So I got that. So we got these black placement mats. <laughs> if you look closely, you can probably tell that they're for Halloween because it has like this little witch room thing on it but like it's black and sparkly and there's nothing else that would signify it being for Halloween so I got it and I think it'll be cute anyway so this was ten dollars and it says comparable price at eighteen dollars and it came in a set of six and it's only four of us so this was a steal I think I got these two pillows um my house is filled well at least my last studio is filled with pillows and pink stuff and when we went originally, I wanted to find ones like this. So I'm probably gonna take two from my house because literally there's like 20 down here that I'm looking at. We do not need this many. I don't know where they came from. I think my mom ordered them, but yeah. So I wanted to get these two um, pillows for the couch because the couch is like a, it's like a dark gray, like I said, with an undertone of like navy blue. Like it's like an ugly color though. So we just have to kind of like, you know, use things that'll make it look nice. I know pink would look nice with it, but my friend doesn't want too much pink because we already have like a lot of pink like items. We have like a pink toaster. I got this like light gray one. It comes in a set of two and this was, this was $18. So yeah. We actually got this knife set. This was OC of steel because originally we wanted a pink knife set and it was so so cute like it held, it, was, it looked really fancy it was just acrylic and all that but nobody bought it and i'm like if we're at ross and i see one right now for literally 20 dollars, and the one we were gonna get was 40 we might as well mind you this is a 25 piece set so it comes with all of these knives the sis kitchen scissors and then it also comes with like measuring spoons measuring cups set of three spatulas and seven knives like it comes with a lot so i feel like we'll be set with just this and obviously everything that each person buys they get to take whenever we leave whenever we decide to leave so i'm actually happy i got the living room and stuff because all of these items are going to be mine next up we got these um clips you know you use these for like chips this, that's the only thing i can think of that we would use this for but i don't know the, this was from ross and it was four dollars uh, a can opener. I really didn't want to get this one because it does not go with our theme because like I don't know It's just rusty and brown, but this was the only one I could find and I'm pretty sure if I got it from Amazon or something It'd be like three more dollars. This was only five dollars from there. So yeah, we also got these two um, like kitchen towels with oven mitts I know my cousin already got oven mitts, but this came with it and it was only seven dollars for one so both of these were fourteen dollars but it's so dumb because for one it literally comes with just one oven mitt 
like they should have just sold it all together for $14 for all that but yeah so for the kitchen we got this little um kitchen mat you know just like from in front of the sink really excited about this y'all I wish I could have been patient and just waited till everything came but since I didn't find everything at the store yesterday as soon as I got home I ordered some things from Amazon so this I got this from the store this is going to go on our coffee table but for the coffee table I ordered these designer books like Chanel, Valentino, Dior, and I think there's one more, so it comes with four. I mean, I'm pretty sure nobody would steal our <laughs> doormat, but I don't know. We'll see what the vibes are gi giving when we get there. I'm already not even too excited because, like, my cousin and my friend, like, they already kind of went there, and they're already saying, like, how some of the things are messed up, and they have to call maintenance. Like, no, I'm not having that. But anyway, we got this. I don't know if you guys saw... Or remember me and my mom were talking about this little plant yesterday um my mom wanted to get like the another plant holder for it and like put the plants inside of the, the little gold thing but it just this part was too high this part was too high and I didn't think it looked good so I was like we might as well just get this since white is probably gonna be like you know a factor so yeah, this is really cute. This was $25. Another thing with Ross's pricing, like I feel like it's a bit like random. Like I don't think that this little fake plant is worth more than this, but I don't know. All right, and then the last two in this were these like bowls. This is a mixing bowl. This was $6 and then this was, like this is like a Tupperware bowl. So this will be like, you know, if we cook and we want to keep some food. The last bag that I have is I got this and this one is pretty high y'all so I also ordered you know the feather the pink feather thing that I showed you guys in here I ordered this but in 48 inches and nude so I'm hoping it'll go with this like nude but I thought this was really cute so we'll have this up in our house and then I just hope the feathers fit because if it literally goes in and slides down I'm gonna be pissed and then the last thing is this dish rack. Based off the dish rack that we have at my house, I wasn't too happy with finding this one, but I low-key was happy that we still even found one at Ross for only $16, because on Amazon, the one I was about to get was like $30. So I'm happy I found this one. But what I meant by the one thing at my house, like that one is two stories. So you can put, um, put all the plates and stuff in and then there's like a little bit of a higher place for like specifically the cups there's like things where you can hang the cups on and i'm just wondering like where we're gonna put our cups but hopefully it all works out or something but this was only 15 dollars, and i think this was a good price we have this for the spoons and stuff so i hope this fits all right y'all all right y'all so that is all i have for today these are all the things that i got for back to school so far like i said i do have a few things still coming but I'm not waiting for them you should have been here you should have been here when the bus left aka I'm the bus so yeah I left and yeah I'm pretty happy with all the things that I got I haven't had to like return anything except for like the cutting board I was thinking about returning it but the return process I just don't like going to the store having to like return something like no I just I'd rather just keep it but yeah so in total in this haul if I'm really being honest so we spent $700 yesterday at Ross. The first transaction was three something and then the second one was three something again. So um, I know for a fact it was seven something or at least like high 600. And then with all the clothes that I bought, I like I said, I know I spent over a thousand because the Gucci shoes that I bought, they were like 700. Those, those dunks that I got were 200, that's 900 already. The hair that I bought was 400, 900. That's 1300 with just the shoes and the hair. And then the clothes that I bought, um, I know my Shein card was probably about like 200. And then I also bought clothes from other places that also just didn't come yet. So I know I probably spent from the, for the clothing portion, like the things I showed y'all upstairs, I probably spent like 1500 on those. But yeah, I mean, I'm really happy with all the things that I got. I'm really excited to move in just because it's like a new environment. Like I was just in a dorm last year, now I'm gonna be in an apartment. I like new things. So 
I'm really excited about that. I have a lot of content coming out this month or like within the next couple of weeks. Like if I could post every day, I would because I have so much to show y'all. So aside from just showing you guys what I've bought so far, just stay tuned for just like the whole nine yards. So if you made it to this part of the video, thank you for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at Lita Vinci. Follow my last page at Willie's by LK. Yeah, happy back to school guys. Thank <laughs> you.